we're bringing you yet another zucchini recipe because when it rains it pours with zucchini so we're going to do some breaded zucchini chips this time it's a quick and easy recipe we're just gonna slice up our zucchini into about quarter inch pieces next we're gonna get our breading station set up we used some almond milk here so we kept it vegan but if you are able to do eggs you could whisk up an egg and your breadcrumbs will stick a lot better so we're using a half cup of gluten-free breadcrumbs. We made our own from gluten-free sourdough. Then we're going to add a half cup of almond flour. You'll notice it's add this later. A quarter teaspoon of garlic powder, quarter teaspoon onion powder, quarter teaspoon salt, and then give it a stir. We're gonna give a quick spray to our tray and then start dipping. Try to keep one hand wet and one hand dry or you're gonna end up with your fingers all covered in breadcrumbs. Now you'll notice how it's not sticking very well on this first zucchini piece and this is when I add the almond flour because my crumbs were much too coarse that they weren't sticking very well and using an egg would also help here but once we add the almond flour just give it a stir and then we have some fine particles in there that will coat our zucchini much better. I do love how crunchy this breading mixture got after it was baked and the flavor was on point with some garlic and some onion flavor coming through. So we're just going to go through and we're going to coat every single one of these zucchini pieces and put them on the tray. In the meantime, you can get your oven preheating to 325 Fahrenheit and then give the tops of them a quick spray with some more cooking spray before they go in the oven. After 20 minutes, you're going to want to pull them out and we're going to flip them over. And once you flip them all over, we're gonna pop them back in the oven for another 20 minutes. And when they're all done, they're gonna be crunchy on the outside and they're going to be soft on the inside and absolutely addictive. All right, after this, if you still have zucchini, let me know if you want some more recipes and what you would you like to see. Do you want some brownies next time?